It's a bye week for both the TRU basketball teams, but the volleyball teams are back at the Tournament Capital Center on Friday and Saturday night following a trip to Winnipeg last weekend. The Wolfpack women are coming off a split against the Westmen. The loss on Friday was their first straight sets defeat of the season, but head coach Chad Grimm was happy with how his team responded the next night with a win on the road. I think to be successful, you can't get swept and you have to be able to compete on the road. I didn't think we did a great job on Friday night in Winnipeg. Uh, I mean, they played tough, but we we didn't bring our, uh, our A game. So, I mean, we could either fold up in the next night and say it was a bad weekend or we could battle back and, and it's nice to see the team be able to do that. At 10 and 4, TRU is third in Canada West and in the hunt for a home playoff game, which has never happened in the program. But Grimm says it won't be easy to secure that home playoff date. We're going to have a tough run coming up here. I mean, Manitoba comes in, they're a more physical team. And then we'll have, you know, Mount Royal, who's up at the top of the standings. We still have Trinity left. We have a tough UBCO team. We have Grant Mack that's right in our zone. So it doesn't get easy. We won't have any easy weekends coming down the stretch. And then hopefully we put ourselves in a decent spot come playoff time. The TRU men, meantime, are struggling at 2-10 and 10 on the year. Losers of three in a row in six of their last seven games. They sit second to last in Canada West and host the University of Manitoba, which is seventh in fighting for one of those final playoff spots. This is one of 12 kills for him. As, from us as a coaching standpoint, it's, it's a, a little troubling uh, to have such a talented team and be where we're at right now. So I would hope there's a bit of desperation and uh, sort of more encouragement this week to do well in practice and beat Manitoba. Can you put your finger on what's not gone like, according to plan with this team? Uh, no, and that's probably the most frustrating thing is that uh, we've, we've tried a lot of things and I think we've got a pretty good team here. We've got a lot of experience, uh, but it's one of those great mysteries right now where we're, we're really searching to find uh, what it is that's going to get people A, motivated and, uh, and B, to have some confidence and belief in themselves when they step on the floor. Back again with the kill.